I thought I would do a different video today. This video is going to be my Nintendo handheld system collection video. And I'm going to show you the ones that I have in my collection, of course. So let's do this. So here we have the, um, the original 3DS and the 3DS XL. So I'll just do a comparison here. So we have the front and as you can see the camera is the same spot and with the XL we have the cartridge here on the um, bottom here at the front, the head jack and the stylus and also the power button here. So that's pretty cool and with the original one we only have the head jack and a few little lights here to tell us the power's on. So yeah. So the cameras are in the same spot, which is cool. And then on the back here, with the XL, we have the cable for charging and the infrared port here, which is the same as the top one. And we have the R button and the ZR button and the L button and the ZL button. So we've got four buttons here. With the top one, the original one, we have at the back, we have the R button, we have the charging port for the cable, we have the cartridges, where the cartridge goes, and your stylus, and also your infrared, and also your L, and your R button so they're pretty cool and then if we open them up we have our speakers our speakers are the same if you have a look here um there it's really hard to show on this one because it's so black and dark so yeah but I'll do my best um, we have the camera in the same spot here, there, um, we also have the X, A, B and Y buttons, they're all the same for this one as well, and as you may notice, the power button for this one is on here, opposed to being it on the side of the XL, um, we've got the directional pad here the circle pad here for both of them so that's the same here we've got the home button and as you can see it's only the home button and then we've got the start and select button on the side here with this one we've got the home select and the start button all along here so that's different yeah and as you probably noticed that this one is a Animal Crossing Limited Edition, which is my favourite. I do like this one, so it's really cool. So we'll get on to this one. We have the SP, the Nintendo um, Game Boy SP. And as you can see here, we have a little screen. We've got the button here to turn the display colour bright or low. We've got the... A and B buttons we don't have the other two the X and Y we have the start and the select the directional pad and we have the speaker here so yeah and then if we close it up we have the cartridges slot where the cartridges go on the bottom as you open it up and then this is where the battery goes in here. Then the top we have where the cables go and your L and R button. So that's pretty cool. And then these little knobs here are for like wrist straps. So that's another little added bonus. So yeah, that is the SP, the Game Boy SP. And then here we have my Game Boy Advanced. And I like the feel of this one because, you you know, you like this with it. Um, but this one doesn't have the light-up screen, so it's hard to see in the dark. 
So this one has your directional pad, your A and B, your speaker here, and your start and select on this side, your volume here, and the head jack, and your on and off button here. Turn it on. And um, your volume on this side. And you've got your L button on this side. R button. So that's pretty cool. And where your charging cable goes. So that's awesome. And also you've got your cartridges for where your games go in this slot here. And that's at the back. And then here you have your battery compartment, which is pretty good. We don't use batteries anymore. We use um, power packs. So that's different. Yeah. So do you have any of these in your collection? Which one is your favorite? Yeah. So if you want to see any more of these videos, comment below or like. Um, I just thought it'd be something different. So yeah. So thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.